It's early morning at Sydney's Bankstown Airport and UNSW students are taking to the skies. Once a year under the Flight Experimentation Program, aerospace engineering students team up with student pilots from UNSW Science for a first-hand experience of aircraft behaviour. It's a real school of the air. This course is unique to this university. Other universities do a bit of flying but not the intensity that we have. It's very important they get this experience because if they're going to be designing aircraft, it's important that they realise responsibility inherent in that. And obviously flying brings that home to you fairly aggressively. UNSW offers Australia's only degree in aviation and one of the country's best degrees in aerospace engineering. Along with the usual lectures, students get to grips with practicalities in the cockpits of the UNSW air fleet. And when your classroom is sitting at 2,000 feet, you need to hang on to your pen. My name is Joseph Galachi. I'm third year aerospace engineering student. Today we did a, a few uh, manoeuvres. We started off by doing a, a 63 bank turn, which we were experiencing 2Gs load on our bodies. Then we uh, performed a uh, negative, negative G loads, which was uh, quite fun. It, it's very important for engineering students to get an awareness of what flight operations are all about. So this week does two things. One is it introduces them to flight operations, and secondly, it introduces them to the actual handling of the aircraft. Throughout their degree, aviation students gain a grounding in basic aircraft engineering. The week-long flight experimentation program helps them build a working relationship for the future with aerospace engineers. I'm Rachel Hall, I'm 21 years old. I just finished the Bachelor of Aviation flying stream last year. Taking the engineers up this week has it's actually been a really great experience. This is the first time I've taken passengers other than just my instructor. It's been really interesting and very constructive for um, my flying because I've also had to multitask a bit, talking and um, setting stuff up how they want it and then keeping an eye on what, what's happening outside. While they're flying, they're carrying out experiments. These experiments are to find out various characteristics of the aircraft and how it operates. We did a, a few flight experiments in which we took down a number of data points at different um, altitudes and speeds. It's going to allow us now to calculate loadings on um, the aircraft at uh, different bank angles. Well most of these students become designers and I guess the most important thing is that they'll be aware of the responsibility that designing an aircraft has. Others will go into operations side working for the airlines and they also need to be aware of that. So probably more important than the technical stuff they learn is an awareness of the responsibility that aerospace engineers have. And for the aviation students it's another valuable part of a holistic approach to the industry, which will pay dividends throughout their careers. By doing a degree, um, firstly, the university has an extremely high standard of professionalism and training that they provide um, the students with, so I think our level of competency in the air is a lot higher than a lot of other pilots, so we're safer, um, we've got a better understanding of how everything works. It's these slight experiences that make you enjoy the course that you're in a little bit more. And I think that's what, what, what we need. We need a little bit more kind of depth and, and, and view as to what our field kind of involves. We see a lot of grins both when they go and when they come back. And you know, it's an achievement to them in a way to have completed the operation. What was it like? Unbelievable. Yeah. It was amazing. It's a great pilot. I think it's the only point runway right for next hour. Apparently, man.